Hello everyone, I am Vani from Ingvarta and I hope that you all are doing amazingly well. So today I am back with our episode 4 of Commonly Mispronounced Words. And if you haven't watched our previous episodes, then the link would be shared in the description box below. Do watch it. So let's move ahead to our first word. Carrier. It's career. Once again, career. Rahul had a very bright career in the field of medicine. Word number two. Cupboard. It's cupboard. Once again, cupboard. I keep all my essentials locked in a cupboard. Word number three. Saturday. It's Saturday. Once again, Saturday. Let's plan a trip to Goa this Saturday. Word number four. Buffet. It might be written as B-U-F-F-E-T, but the correct pronunciation is buffet. Once again, buffet. There was a large buffet displayed at the wedding. Word number five, cucumber. It's cucumber. Once again, cucumber. I love having cucumber salad in the summer. And just to add on a bit, there are three more words which were requested by our users. The first one is comprehension. Once again, comprehension. Comprehension is basically an action or capability of understanding something. And the sentence that you can form with this word is, sometimes solving mathematical problems can go way beyond my comprehension which is true. Word number two, embrace. Once again, embrace. Embrace is when you hold on to something in a very affectionate manner. Like the example sentence that you can form with this is that my mother embraced me when I met her after a month, which is generally what mothers do when you meet them after a long time. Word number three, embarrassing. Once again, embarrassing. Embarrassing means when you feel awkward or ashamed of something. And the example sentence could be that it was very embarrassing when my colleague started to laugh at me for my incorrect pronunciation. So these are some words which are commonly mispronounced. And if you want to learn them quickly, all you have to do is watch the video twice or thrice and once you are sure of the words and ready to go, repeat the words after me. And then you will get the words on your tongue instantly. And now moving on to the best part of the video, your assignment. Well, today your assignment is very easy. All you have to do is you have to tell me a phrase that you would use to describe a person who works really hard and write it in the comment box below. And if you already have been following my past videos, then this assignment would be very easy for you. I hope to see you very soon next time. Like, subscribe and share this video. Until then, be safe and happy learning. Ingvarta, your English practice playground. No judgment, only motivation and constructive feedback. Join today.